Hello, I'm Dr. Sunita Jane. I'm a physiatrist and the chair of the Baptist Physician Wellness Committee. The Wellness Committee is made up of physicians who are dedicated to helping their colleagues in these challenging times. As you all know, uh, nationwide, nearly half of us have been experiencing episodes of burnout, as well as depression and overwhelming stress, which impacts not only our professional life, but also our personal life. So the mission of the Wellness Committee is to provide resources and education to help recognize burnout, to manage stress, as well as help build resiliency and restore the work-life balance. And of course, we also wanna help find the joy that we find in our work. You will hear from the rest of the uh, Wellness Committee members in regards to the resources and the programs that are available. And certainly, as you will hear, we want you to reach out to us through our confidential care line, which is 901-CARE-1, or reach out to the colleague who is representing your facility of practice. I'm Dr. Dash Sidhu, and I want to talk to you about burnout. It is very common amongst physicians. It can affect you, your family, your patient care, and even health outcomes. It progresses slowly. You may first feel disappointment and fatigue, then frustration and indifference, followed by a sense of powerlessness and professional failure, and finally, isolation and apathy. By the time you reach burnout, you're emotionally exhausted. You feel no sense of professional accomplishment and you might be thinking of even leaving your job. Burnout can cause physical symptoms like headache and insomnia, psychological symptoms like anger, depression, or addictive behavior, and social symptoms like inability to communicate with others, marital dysfunction, and even questioning your own spiritual beliefs. Any physician can experience it, but it is more common in younger physicians and female physicians, and also those in certain specialties like critical care, emergency medicine, obstetrics and gynecology, and internal medicine. The most common causes include work-life imbalance, a lack of control over one's work, and an increased use of computers. If you're suffering from a burnout, you may feel hopeless, but you can defeat it. And like many disorders, early detection is the key. Once you recognize the symptoms, you can do many things to overcome it. You can make personal and professional changes and practice mindfulness where you empower yourself to accept the present moment with balanced awareness without clinging or rejection. And you can call us confidentially at 901-227-3663 or 901-CARE-1. We can help you and guide you and even find professionals who can help you to reach a happier, more fulfilling life. To learn more about burnout, you can download my presentation at the link below. Thank you. Hi, I'm Dr. Tom Greenwell, and as a member of the Physician Wellness Committee, I'm here to emphasize two major points. The first is confidentiality. From the time you make the initial call, through our early conversations, to the point where you get counseling or perhaps you utilize some of the other services we offer, no one will be informed of anything. We maintain 100% confidentiality. There's no communication with the hospital. There's no communication with your group. There's no communication with any organization or outside agencies. This is 100% confidential. Don't let the fact that you're afraid of confidentiality keep you from getting the help you may need. The second point I wanna make is this group is made up of six physicians. We are all in private practice. We understand what it's like, the highs, the lows, and the challenges facing everyone in medicine today. So when you call 901-227-3663 or 901-CARE-1, you will get one of us. We're there to help you, we're there to lead you through the steps, and we're there to ensure that you get the best care possible. Please don't hesitate to call us when you need us.
Hi, I'm Mitch Beatis. I'm one of the infectious disease physicians at Baptist Memphis. I'd like to talk to you about some of the other resources that are available outside the Memphis area. We've been able to connect some of our physicians with programs that are available in the Southeast and the Midwest, which includes Nashville, New Orleans, and Kansas City. All of these programs provide in-person evaluations and in-person treatment programs. Remember, everything is confidential, and the first step is contacting us either personally, individually, or you can call us at 1-901-CARE-1, 227-3663, and we will help you get on your first steps towards recovery. Hello, I'm Dr. Neil Beckford, and I'm here to discuss one of the newest features of our program, our partnership with the Concern Employees Assistance Program. Each member of the Concern team holds at least a master's degree, and they're all licensed professional counselors or licensed clinical social workers. They help people sort through issues like burnout and get them back on track, both professionally and personally. And they can help make your life better too. This is a completely free service to you and anyone living in your home. You can talk to counselors in person, by phone, or through telehealth. They even offer 24-hour emergency on-call availability. And most importantly, all sessions are completely confidential. I encourage you to take advantage of this valuable service if you believe you are experiencing burnout or any other psychosocial or emotional issues. The stress of our jobs affects all of us, and seeking help is an act of strength, not weakness. You're taking control of your life and refusing to let those circumstances control you. If you are ready to take this important step towards personal well-being, you can call Concern at 901-458-4000 or visit myconcerneap.com. Good evening, my name is Dr. Jeremiah Tyson. I currently practice emergency medicine at Baptist Tipton. And I just want to thank you all for taking the time to watch this presentation today. Uh, during the past three years, the Wellness Committee has sought to help physicians who are having problems with depression, burnout, anxiety. Uh, please feel free to give that number a call if you're having any of those symptoms. Please, in the future, be aware that we'll be having a grand rounds as well as other presentations coming forth from the Wellness Committee. Again, if you have any problems, feel free to reach out, especially in the Tipton area, uh, where we can assist you with these problems. Again, Dr. Jeremiah Tyson, we thank you so much for being a part of this forum. We continue to look forward to helping and serving you as physicians. Thank you.